Greetings everybody and welcome to Let's Play 7 Days to Die Alpha 15 Multiplayer. I'm here with Saber. Hiya! Woo! And uh, in the last episode we ended off at the bank. We're still in the hub city looking for like all the mechanical parts and stuff. We found like hardly anything so far. Uh, we're really not having good luck but we stumbled across a bank and we've gone ahead and opened all the safes. So uh, I, think, uh, I think Christmas has come Yay! early. So yeah, I think Christmas has come early, so uh, do you want to do the left side and I'll do the right side and then we'll go, or whatever side we happen to be on and we'll just meet in the no, middle? I mean, yeah. Yeah? Okay. Let's do it. So, Brown pistol barrel. I, I found another Orange. nail gun schematic, so you read the last one, so I'll read that one. That's a good one. Orange shotgun receiver and uh, leather leg armor. Do you know? You know leg armor, don't you? Because you made some, so I'll just uh, scrap that. I've got a yellow 276 saw and 15 rounds to nice. go with it. I got 35 paper. Woo! Yeehaw! I got some uh, orange shotgun parts, shotgun receiver, some paper. They're not in very good condition, though. Yeah, I got a brown hunting rifle stock. So, not bad. That's all that was in there. Um, and now, we have this room. So we went ahead and opened the vault as well, and uh, unfortunately there used to be, um, in Alpha 14 there used to be 12 in the vault, but they've nerfed it now, there's only 9. So they've taken out, you can see, they've taken out the top 3 um, inside the vault, so there's less stuff to actually get from the vaults now, which kind of sucks, but do you want to do the same yeah. as before, do uh, left and right? Well, I'm full up, so I have to go do some emptying, because I was taking stuff apart in there that while. There should be room Where in your, are our bikes? Uh, outside the uh i think they're outside this bit i think uh i don't know though maybe they're out here yeah there's there's one out here i don't know if this is yours or not um hang on let me just check well this one's empty so you can come yep, that's stuff my here. one yeah because yeah. you emptied everything out of it yeah i'm not sure where the other mini bike is i don't even know where i parked mine so you should probably get this pistol actually and use it because you didn't bring anything with you i've got a i got a pistol here I've got a, uh, a blue one here. Um, I do have 11 mechanical parts so far, by the way. Nice. Oh, here's my bike. All right, I'm going to come move my bike nearer to you so that we can not lose each other. <laughs> come on. So you got 11 mechanical parts. That's awesome. All right, let me... So far, there we go. I probably should just hold on to them because I'm just going to get more We're of gonna them. We're going to find more, yeah. We're kind of on the quest for it, so we may as well just hold on to them. Yep. Anyway, do you want to get that pistol and the bullets out? Um, I've got, have... a I got a pistol, but where's the... Uh... Bullets. Are they in your? Are they yeah, they I assume. should be in the bike. Yep. Got them. Right. So back we go. All right. right. So back now into the we vaults. can open some of these. Yes. All right. right. I'll start with the bottom right. Uh, what the hell is that? Uh, uh lumberjack. Shit. Hang on. He's breaking through the door. So he could have come in this way. Door. He could have come in this way, but he decided that he was going to try and break through iron instead of glass. So. Here he is, little bugger. Come here, you. Ah, ah. Right, your kill, go for it. Yeah! What did he have on him? He dead? Yeah, he had two cl he had two cloth on him, so nothing great, but oh well. Right, now we can go and do this vault. So let's see what's, uh... <laughs> Anyway, I got a um, mini bike for dumb shit and an orange pistol grip. Way, so... You've already read the mini bike book. Yep, so that's um, yours. As have I. Oh, okay. Um, so I guess scrap it. I think it only does miscrafting, right? Yeah, it does miscellaneous crafting, so I can just do. I can just scrappy do that. Yep, right. I found uh, leather chest armor schematic, so that's uh, that's good for me because I've not learned that one yet, but you've got it. Um, I found another mini bikes for dumb shits book. Oh my nice. god. Nice. Okay. Uh, I got some paper. Scrap that. I got a uh, hunting rifle to receive a green and a hunting rifle stock brown uh, or no orange even. Sorry. Go color blind. <laughs> what have you got? Um, I got a gas can schematic. I don't think we have yes! that yet. Awesome. Yeah, we, that's that's very good. We need that. Um, I got five 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 pistol parts, which is amazing. And I got. Do you know the sword off shotgun yet? I think I do. Okay, I'll leave it. In, um, I'll leave it in the top left safe just in case you don't. But there is a schematic for it in there. Um, there's an SMG schematic. Have you already read that? Um, I, I have not. I don't know. Um, 
All right, have a look. See. I will. Right in this one, in the bottom middle one, I found an auger schematic, which I know. So I think you need that. I found quality six hundred four four magnum parts, which is awesome, and a one seven one pistol receiver. So I'll leave that auger one in the bottom middle for you, because I don't know if you know right. that one already. Um, I do not. Which one did you leave the uh, other Top thingy in? Top middle. Top middle. Um, okay. Awesome, let's see. And... Um, I don't know that one yet, so I'll read that. Excellent. And then the last one was a yellow pistol receiver. So I think that's all of them now. Look at, in, the, in the top left one, there's a uh, schematic, just in case you don't know it. If you do, then just scrap it. Um, I think, though, that I is... I do know it. You do? Yeah, just scrap it then. I think, though, that is all the safes. Uh, all the safes. And it's now nighttime as well. So you know what that means, guys? There's going to be roaming zombie bears and uh, all kinds of nasties. And uh, tomorrow is day 19 as well. So that also means it's dog day. So we've got plenty to look forward to so oh, fun what do you want to do Saber? do you want to do a bit of a night loot or do you want to head back and uh consolidate what we've got it's totally up to you um how much room do you have left i have about i have my all, all the space for my mini bike so we can put loads of stuff in there and all right well um, then let's do some more lootage all um, right, but so. we need to decide quickly where we want to go before shit starts showing up yeah um so we've done the working stiffs and the shotgun messiahs which are in the in the square next to us uh to the uh east um this square i think we've done all of them that's where the cracker books were the bank We've done the shanty town in this square. Uh, we've done the cracker books in the one below that. There's a skate park in there and buzz bar, so that's pretty much done. Um, there's a power plant. Um, there's a power plant we can go to. Uh, that might have a load of mechanical parts in it, but I'm not sure. Um, it's in the uh, it's in the square to the southeast of ours. It looks like that's a power plant building. Yeah, power plant building might be good. Yeah, do you want to go there? Um, I can yeah, because yeah, okay. they usually have like a working stiff box uh, yeah, exactly. and stuff like that. So. Um, so yeah, I will uh, I'll sh try and get around and show you where that is. I think it's over this way. Let's turn our light on there so we can see what's coming for us to try and kill us. Right, let's uh, have a look. Yeah, here we go. Right, yeah, there's a power plant right here. So I don't know if there's a way in already. Let's uh, have a little explore around the outside just to see if there's any quick and easy ways inside, but I don't think there is. Uh, doesn't look like it, so we're going to have to break our way into it. There's no zombies here, though, yet. Oh, no, no, wait, 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 there is. Right here. Right there. Oh, sorry, Saber. <laughs> right here, so I'm just going to put the bike inside. Yeah, let's come in here. Because there's loads of cars in here as well, so we can, uh, we'll, we'll be a little bit safer from an imminent zombie attack in here. So, probably for the best. Uh, I'm probably going to turn my mini bike light off as well. Um, so let me go and turn that for. Ah! Oops! I hit you. Sorry, my bad. Ah! My bad! Oh, and I hit you. I hit you again. My bad! <laughs> what am I going to do without my spine? Right, so I found right, air so... filters and things in that car. So I guess we can take the cars apart in, in hopes of getting mechanical parts too, because I know there is a drop chance in cars. I'm going to use some uh, wood frames and uh, yeah block things off good block idea. things off just a wee bit a wee bit but at least we'll get some <laughs> gas at least we'll get some gas out of here as well from taking the cars apart so we can uh, fuel up our bikes which is going to be a good thing so no mechanical parts there uh what's in this car in this car we have oh i found a uh, i found a purple quality lock in here that is awesome oh wow those things are so rare too i know so I didn't expect that. So I will, uh, I will give your, I'll give your bike the good one, and I'll put the crappy one in mine. So let's go All ahead right. and put the crappy what one. What was in I mine. gonna do with this? That's what I, I gonna don't do. know. Save a star. Right. So let's see if we can get some mechanical parts out of these cars. Come on, there must be some. I need to get springs out of these, so we're gonna want to keep those. But mechanical parts, I'm not sure. Let's have a look. Um, I've not found any yet, so let's have a look in this one. So we've got um, nails in that one. Okay, I'll take them. Let's see what we've got in here. Come on. Or at least a really good quality engine would be nice, but we'll see. Yeah, because we got the mini bikes book. We just, uh, yeah. Um, and we've got our mini bikes, but we could always use better parts or make exactly, extra. Exactly, yes. Um, I hear a zombie somewhere. 
Uh, yep. Uh oh, wondering what's coming. Time for the pistol, he thinks. Um, keeps moving. Yep. Oh, there's. Yep, there's a lot of them. There's a lot of them. Oh, snap. There's loads of them. Just trying to pick them off if I can. Yeah, I'm out of arrows, so all I have is my gun. Yeah, do it. Oh. They're trying to they're trying to break in. This is good. Uh, right, there's a uh, there's a guy there. Get down, you. Oh, I'm here. I'm shooting the bike. God damn it. Get out of there. Dang it. Get down. Right, he's down. Keep your head still. Get yeah, down. I know, right? Got him. Right, he's down. Right, you. Get out of here. Right. Okay, got the nurse. Where are you going? Oh god damn it. Come on then. God, just when you think you're safe, right? Uh where is she? Yep, there she is. Got her. Oh man. Okay, they've broken through some of that fence. Um let me see if I can repair it. No, can't repair those bits. Um Damn! God, they came in they came in quick, didn't they? Are you get are you getting cold? I am. I'm at like 30 degrees. Yeah. We're gonna have to try and get inside if we can. See what we get in here. Come on, give us some mechanical parts. We got... Uh, I didn't get any from that one. Right. You grab that one, I'll grab this one. See what we get. Come on. Come on, give me some. Got a light, that's good. That's uh, good money at the traders. No... Yeah, I believe I did get a mechanical part actually, so... Nice! Okay, what's um... in this... Uh... So, did I get one? No, I got none out of any of those. So, no mechanical parts in those cars, unfortunately. Um, so, I guess we need to get inside there because we're going to freeze otherwise. So, let's uh, see if we can break our way in there. Here. We'll be safer in here as well. Oh, another zombie, another zombie. Crap, where are you? Where are you at? Oh, it's a crawler. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> I just had to. I just had to give him a load of shots because he, um, he was like his head was inside the wall, so there's no way I could have just killed him. So let's have a look. So we can scrap those, and I guess we can just scrap the pipes because we don't need them at the moment. Right. So uh, yeah, I'm just gonna quickly break in here. Oh, there's loads of these chairs in here. We can take these apart. That'll give us mechanical parts. Yes. Excellent. I got two from that one, and I got one from that one. Yes. Uh, okay, shirt in there. Let's have a look, see what we got. Uh, okay, I'm gonna. I'll probably go down the bottom first. I'm gonna oh, head up. There's a skirt. Nice. I can wear that. Better than my one. Um, a helmet. Not bad. And some more overalls. What have we got in here? Iron pipes and some jars. And nothing in that one. Okay, let's head down. Uh, what do we have in here? Brass and oil. Okay, we'll, get, we'll start warming up down here now. Yeah, there we go. Now we're at 41. Good, good. Right, what have we got in here? So, um, okay, there's three boxes. So I've got some iron pipes, some more nails, some candy tins, um, some glue. And uh, just for pound too loud, because I know you like me getting the box behind that one. There we go. Mm -hmm. And we got some nails in there. Um, so nothing too good in, the, in that Oh, box. i got to make sure I get the cubby hole. The, yes. You have to, you have to put uh, uh, wood frames up to get to it. Yes. You know what I'm talking about, right? I think, I think so, yeah. I th yeah, I think I know what you mean. Um, but, hang on, let me come see where you are. Oh, where? No, I, it's down. It's down here. What do you mean? Where um, is, is there is there a cubby hole in this bit? I never knew there was. It's in the electrical plants, and this is the the plant. Are right? you, sure, you sure it's not in the big in the bigger one? It oh, might, it might be in the bigger one. It might be down there, but yeah, there might there might be one in here. I've not I've never seen one in here. Oh, there, um... there might be. Um, right, so I'm in the working stiff box room now, so the corpse has two short iron pipes, not bad. Um, there's some feathers and duct tape in there, and I'm full! Great! Uh, let me repair those. Repair that, repair that. What does that take? Yeah, I thought it of? was, uh, I thought it was like at the bottom of the stairs, but it might be in the bigger one. Maybe. 
Um, okay, so those are repaired, and I can scrap them all so we can turn them into cloth. And I get my tailoring out that way as well, which is good. Uh, Buffer coat! I'll wear that! Yes, that's going to be good for you. Um, I did find one earlier, but I didn't expect we'd be getting cold in the Hub City, so I did kind of scrap it, but never mind. Um, so let's drop that. Uh, oh, I meant to scrap it. Oh, never mind. Scrap you, and do I have just regular lead on me right now? I don't, so I'll keep these together. And scrap that. Alrighty, so uh, in this top one we have uh, some paper. Right, and I think some it's glass. at the bottom of this one. Yes, there's like a broken ladder. Uh, hang on, where you at? I'm seeing, I'm seeing some weird world glitches right now. Um, I am where? Nope, nope. Come back, come back, come back, come I'll back. Come back, come back, come back, come back. Uh, where even are you? I, I see. Up there. Some... Other, uh, sir. Okay, come here, come here. Where even are you? I cannot see you. Right. Hello. Oh, okay. there you are. Right. <laughs> okay. Stand here and look towards the stairs, but look all the way up towards the ceiling. Oh, yeah. See that hole up there? Yes. I never noticed that before. I knew there was a ladder there, but I didn't know there's actually anything up there. There's a body and a backpack. Nice. Want to see? Yeah, go for it. Since you've never gotten to see it before, go ahead. Uh, right. Have we got um, wood frames or something? Hunting knife book. <laughs> Do you know that one? Yeah, I've got some wood frames. Do you want me to put some in the... the here, I'll put some in this box for you. Yay! Thank you, Superstar. The one you're standing on top of. Woo! That way you can see, because you've never got to see up there before. Nerd pole! Right, let's uh, make my merry way up here, if I can. Come on. Oh, yeah! I never realized there was a, a little place up here before. Um, okay, so we got, uh -huh. a, uh, we got a 4 4 magnum frame, a green one. That's pretty good. And nice. in the backpack, we have... Nothing. Absolutely nothing in the backpack. Ah! <laughs> oh man! Bra 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 bra. Now I really don't know what's going on with the world right now because I'm seeing like really weird stuff like in the pack. Oh, there, there you go. You you just removed that thing and that's gone. <laughs> that was awesome. Um, so I guess in, in here we'll find loads of springs and electrical parts. I'm not sure about mechanical parts, but. We can try taking some of this stuff apart and see what we get. We might get some. If we do, then we are in. Um, so let me have a look, see if I get any. There's electrical parts. No mechanical parts there, though. Let's have a look in here. Yeah, I'm getting electrical parts and electrical components yeah. and like, pipes. And... It doesn't seem like we're getting mechanical parts, though. How about these transformers? Um, am I getting any out of them? No, I think I got a electrical stuff out of those before. Yeah, not getting anything out of those. Uh, the pipes above it? No, they give you nothing. Hmm. Does those give like... you electrical? Um, or are you talking about? I'm talking about these those, ones. those small pipes there. Yeah. Yeah. The wrench just tries to hit it. Just yeah. To actually, take it apart. There's stuff behind it, but I don't know if you get any mechanical. Yeah, I've still got three mechanical parts. But it doesn't look like we're getting much out of these. Apart from electrical stuff. Oh, oh well. I'm getting some scrap iron. Yeah, scrap iron is always good. But I think that's literally all we're going to have from here. Man, mechanical parts are really hard to find. I did not realise how hard they were to find until today. Um, uh, we, we definitely need to get steel smithing 3 to make these things. Um, <laughs> yeah. Because it's just. Right. Take, I think this is pretty much pretty much done. Yeah, there's not much else in here. So you, you did the roof Unless... already, didn't you? <laughs> yes. Unless you want to, you know, uh, take stuff apart to get scrap iron. Um, we could do. Um, do you want to do that and then come back once we've uh, completely dismantled all this? Yeah, we could do. Alrighty then. So we'll be back in just a bit. Alrighty guys, we are back, and as you can see, we've been doing stuff all night. Now, if you look at the power plant right now, apart from the perimeter, there is not a shred of iron inside. Oh, apart from that bit there, apart from that bit, I need, I need to get that bit. There's, there's iron there. We've been uh, working all night to get every little bit of iron we can out of this power plant, including the four, like, shaft things here, and, uh, like, everything inside. So if you come inside, look, you can see the roof is gone. We've taken, like, everything out of here, and uh, down in the middle here, all of the electronic equipment and the iron flooring had disappeared. So you can see there's absolutely no iron really left down here. Maybe the ladders? Oh, there's one ladder. There we go. Got it. That's it. That's all the iron now, I think, out of this entire place. And what we did was when we uh, started digging this out, 
you can see that we struck gold. We found more potassium, which is amazing. Saber. And and iron. And iron, yes. So there's more potassium, there's more iron. Um, and my inventory is full right now, so I can't actually carry any more. But, um, yeah, we're going to have to start mining this out at some point because there's a lot there. Um, and that's that's probably, that's probably more than what we found in our other area. So, oh, well, I'm sure it is. Let's have a look and see. I'm going to scrap some stuff so I can come help you mine. Uh, so you can scrap those, scrap those. So, yeah, is your bike full up? Not yet. I'll probably go up and put some stuff in there. there in a minute. Yeah, go put stuff in your bike. But I want to mine potassium. <laughs> Gotta make room for the potassium. Nitrate. So, yeah, there's a little bit around here. See how much we can find. Oh, yeah, it's going down there. That's good. Yeah, it, it goes down, so I think there's quite a bit. Yes! Now, today is actually dog day as well, so uh, unfortunately, now that we've taken out most of the building stuff above us, the dogs might actually break down and just, like, drop in. Uh, however, zombie fall damage is back in Alpha 15, so uh, hopefully they'll take a little bit of damage before they manage to drop down if they appear at all. Um, but, yeah, we're going to have to see if the dogs actually show up, because I've had dog days where there have been no dogs. Um, so we'll see. We'll see what happens. Yeah, there's uh, plenty of potassium and iron down here, which is awesome. So we're going to have to go and start digging all this stuff out. Um, and then that's going to hopefully be enough to uh, get us enough gunpowder and all that stuff that Save is going to need for her uh, sniper rifle rounds and for some other stuff like shotgun shells and things as well for day 21. So although we haven't really been doing much base building this week um, for like the day 21 horde and getting ready for it, I think this kind of makes up for that by the fact that we're now actually going to be able to make gun things um, and ammo and all that, which is definitely going to help us out. So yeah, lots of mining and stuff that we've been doing. Still need to find mechanical parts though. Um, we found a few, but still not too many. Yeah, we've only got enough to make one drawbridge at the moment. Yeah, we need more. How many? Because I think you found 10 right in here. 11. 11. So yeah, it's still, still, yeah, still not too many. All the, from all the stuff I took apart in here and from the bank, yeah, I managed to get 11. Yeah. Which kind of sucks. In the funeral home. Yeah. yeah. I mean, the apartment was the worst. There was only 20 in the entire place. So, uh, anyone anyone who wants to get parts, then, uh, yeah, don't go to the, uh, don't go to the workbench. And I think my buzzer is going right now, so, uh, I don't know who is here, but I'm not going to answer it. So, I'm sorry, guys, if you, uh, if you're experiencing buzzing noises, I'll try and edit it out. But yeah, it's pretty loud. Hopefully it'll go away in a minute. But yeah, plenty of stuff to, to uh, mine out, but... Let's see. Yeah, there's more potassium over here as well. We found... Yes, there's th tons of it. There's tons of it. Yes, this is much better. And, um... Well, with doing all the mining that we've done, we've got a crap ton of iron, so we're hoping that we can get some steel going and be able to upgrade, you know, all of our cement Everything, stuff to steel. Yeah. For should, the next horde. We should be able to as well, because, like, we've got some steel already made. So, yes. we just have to pretty much use what we've got and then make more. Uh, so, yes. it, it should be fine. Oh, man. Look at all this potassium. This is much better than the vein I found on the ground. So, yeah, guys. My pro, pro tip for mining. Look under the power plants, because it's so easy to get down to stone and get loads of stuff. I mean, it happened in my single player world, and now it's happening in this world as well. So uh, yeah, yeah, it seems to be a seems to be a pretty good tip, I think. Oh yes, there's more. Yes, yes. Hidden iron and potassium. So Nitrate it's all good. power. And that that means as well that um, we're planning to do a uh, rooftop garden um, for the top of the base as well. So we yes. we should be able to get tons of fertilizer ready for that as well. Make it all uh, make it all ready for that as well, which is going to be really awesome. <laughs> That's going to be amazing. I'm so excited. I am too, because uh, Saber makes really good rooftop gardens. I mean, you <laughs> you've probably seen the one in a single player series. If you haven't, then go check it well, out. It's awesome. Your, not sorry, my single no, player. Not your single player, sorry. Your last one to play with later. That's why. Yes. I mean. yeah, yes. Save it. Have you actually done the single player series for seven days? I don't think you have, have you? Mm, I have not. You, I oh have my not. god. You need to do a single player series. I'll come, oh dear. I'll, come watch, I'll come watch that. I'll probably die a lot. Hey! <laughs> but Saber, death is half the fun. Right? <laughs> right? Uh, 
Yeah, sure. <laughs> yeah, see? See, Saber agrees. Death is half the fun. So. Not really. But. When it's, it's called Seven Days to Die. I mean, it's in the game name, right? Right? I'm making sense, right? Yeah? Yeah? yeah. You're dying's not fun. Yeah. I've, I've, I've played games. Uh, I've. The first time I was playing uh, this game with my brother, we were like right next to the hub city. <laughs> and, <laughs> well. <laughs> yeah, and we like couldn't find calipers to save our life like anywhere, and we kept dying from bears and barrels and oh god, all kinds of crap. It it was ridiculous. Yeah, hub city is not oh, the best place. I'm to running set up. out of room. No. Just uh, just dump um, some of the stuff in the mini bike, I guess. Just watch out for dogs out there, because there's going to be dogs out there. That's alright, I'll scrap one light. Uh, maybe. <laughs> maybe. Man, there's a lot of iron down here as well, so we found a fair bit of potassium and some iron as well, so that's definitely much better than what we found before. I'm happy now. I was really annoyed with the potassium vein not giving me anything and giving us mainly lead. So. Yeah, th there's actually not much stone in here. It's almost all iron I know. and potassium. It's amazing. It's fantastic. This is awesome. I'm just worried about dogs dropping in, like, right above us there. There's like That's like prime time for dogs. So we're going to have to be... It's really hard to hear them as well in the rain. Yeah, and so especially when we're banging around so much, too. Yeah. Well, at least we got a bit of defense on the outside, so if we listen very carefully, you might hear them just like attacking the outside bit. Unless they're smart and come in the back where there's that little... Do you want... Actually, do you want me to go and put some wood frames in that entrance bit where we drove in? I uh... did put wood frames where we drove in. Oh, you did? That's... Okay. Yeah, it was only a small little space. Well, you're a million steps ahead of me. Way! <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh no, we missed iron! Guys, we missed some iron. I'm so sorry. There we go. Now we've got all the iron out of the building. And I see more potassium right here. Yes! Yes! Oh. oh, I just found the bunch. Nice. Yeah, this Oh, it's so beautiful! It's, it's glorious! It's beautiful! See, I swear we were like miners or something in a previous life, because we get so we excited by rocks and... and I ore. know! <laughs> it's like, it's stone! It's ore! It's amazing! see if we can find any more on it. I see more iron over here though, so that is awesome. So yeah, power plants seem to be like sat on top of gold mines of iron. And potassium! I, I keep finding more and more and more. I'm not, find, I'm not finding any more. I'm finding loads of iron though, but I'm seeing gravel here, so maybe there's... Is that gravel or is that stone? Oh, it's just stone. I thought I saw gravel. Oh, there's, there's some. Yes! Look at that. Oh man, we are we are hitting the mother load. So uh, I guess it's pretty much we're pretty much gonna just try and exhaust as much of this as we can, um, and then I guess uh, are we gonna do more adventuring saver or do you want to head back to base after this? Um, we're getting so chock a block full. Um, I think we're gonna have to head back to base because I don't. Well, we might be able to go to the traders and sell some stuff. Yeah, um, we could do. He's completely the opposite direction, isn't he? In terms of yeah, like, he is. He is the where we are. Unfortunately, so. Yeah, we're probably going to have to go home and try to get some of this stuff back with us. And then prepare for day 21, um, of course, because uh, there's only two days to go. And then uh, the horde yeah. is going to be back. So, yeah, we've got a lot We got a lot to do before they get here. So we're only going to have to head back and... Hang on. I know. It's fine. The I tough part's it... going to be deciding what to take. Yeah, exactly. I mean... Definitely the potassium, that is coming. That is the first thing I'm taking. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh yeah. Potassium all the way. And all this iron as well for steel. That's that's coming with us. And I'll try we what we can do is combine the gun parts that we've got as well. Um, and that should help. Yeah. And as much of like the clothing and other tools and things like that as well. Yeah, just chuck them all together make one of each if we can or maybe two and then try and, and then yep. i can build all the guns as well so i'll try and build them into like partial guns and then we yep. found that we found a couple of good magnum parts haven't we so we might be able to have a magnum by day 21 if we're lucky oh that'd be freaking awesome that would be very good saber loves oh. the magnum i i do <laughs> i do yeah. oh oh i'm dropping iron i'm shocked uh right i need to go uh I need to go load some stuff in the bike. Are we going to be able to get out of here? Oh, yeah, we are. There's a little bit there. 
Yeah, yeah I could just take those frames out where we came in and. No, no, I mean, I mean from the like the hole that we've dug. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah. It, we, we, we're gonna be able to get out, right? Right? There? Yeah? yeah? Yeah, of course yeah, we are! Yeah, yeah. Oh! Bit of mine! I missed the mine! I thought I got it all, but no, there's more! Yeah! Give me that! I'm so weird getting side over iron. Right, um, let's just ju dunk all these things inside here. So we've, we've got like 200 and some empty glass jars, so if you've got empty glass jars on you, toss them! Um, uh, I have like two, but I'll come back and give them to you in a minute. Uh, I no, could... no, don't give them to me. We've got like 200 and some in the chest where the apartment oh, building is. okay. That's why I said get rid of it. Oh, toss. Okay, I thought you, I thought you meant toss them to me. I was like, okay. No. <laughs> uh, it's like, no, I don't, I don't want that crap. Get it away from me. Oh. God. <laughs> Keep that stuff away. Right, so there's some stone. I guess I can put the full stacks of items in here. Um, what else have we got? Duct tape. I'm not going to find more duct tape. I'm not going to find more food. Um, and I'm definitely not going to find more oil or lights. And probably not more leather or that. There we go. I have one now! You might want to check my mini bike because I probably have a bunch of that stuff in mine too. You could consolidate. Yeah, hang on. I will, uh, I'll be consolidating man. So we have, oh, we have glue and we have duct tape. So I'll take that back. Um, and then I'll make some more duct tape, and then I'll put that back in mine. Consolidation man! Right, what else do we have in here? So, I put the cloth away, didn't I? Oh no, I didn't. Um, okay. Uh, do I have any more in there? Um, nope, I think that is everything I can stash in that one. So, yeah, I think we're, I think we're good. Right, I'm coming back to the mine. So yeah, guys, we're gonna have to uh, we're gonna have to go and do all this mining, get as much potassium and iron as we can, and then we'll probably meet you when we are uh, back at base. So we'll see you in a little while. Alrighty, guys, we are back in the apartment building after doing a heck of a load of mining, and it appears like uh, there's a dog outside. We we heard like a bark and something going on out there. So I think uh, the dogs have come along, but I don't know where they are. So it sounded like they were over. Is that a zombie over there? Yeah, there's a zombie over there, but oh well. It sounded like they're over this side of the building, but I'm not sure they if they... They might have died on your spikes. If so, that would be great, but I'm not even sure. Uh, let's have a look. Because uh, they could have died on the spikes over here. Uh, the spikes are taking a bit of damage, but I don't see any corpses. Um, it sounded like they broke through somewhere. Uh, but I'm not seeing where they've broken in. Hang on. What's this? Nah, the zombies have done some damage to it, but they've not broken in anywhere by the looks of things. No, I don't see them. I think they've gone past. There was definitely a dog here, but it looks like they've uh, they've departed. So I don't know where I don't know where the hell they were, but they gone. Oh, have you found one? <laughs> I just saw her drop dead. <laughs> she had sham sandwiches on her. Yeah, I don't know where the yeah. dogs went. Not seeing any dogs now, so I guess, I guess we got lucky, and uh, they bypassed us, which is excellent. So we don't have to deal with dogs today. Um, right, so back into here we go. So uh, we've been doing some more organising. I actually took over the organising stuff while Saver was sorting some other stuff out, and I think I confused the I confused the heck out of Saver because she was just like, I don't know where anything <laughs> is. But uh, we're gonna have a rundown of all the stuff we got. I've compiled it all, and here we go. So in here. This is all the guns we got. You can see we've nearly got a, a full magnum and shotgun. Some hunting rifle parts which I can't put together yet. And there's like some pistols and there's loads of ammo in that first one. Second one, we've got loads of leather and stuff like that. Some clothes. We scrapped most of the clothing because we didn't need it. Then we got rotten flesh, a couple of fertilizer things. A heck of a load of food and loads of jars. So we are pretty good on that front in the second chest. Third chest is where we've got all our medical stuff, and uh, I guess I should put the food in the second chest as well, but never mind. Uh, we can do that in a minute. Now, the one at the bottom here just has random stuff in it. There's like some candles and like bits of clay and random just random bits and some potted plants that we're probably not even going to bother taking back. Uh, the clay, though, I will take right now. Um, the middle one here has just random things as well, like the parts and like completed forged materials and things like that. So we got like treasure maps as well and some quests and forged steel. So this is like a miscellaneous one as well. And then this top one has all the stuff we've mined. And as you can see, we've got like, I don't know, like over 10,000 iron, like 
30,000 stone. Quite a bit of sand. There's more iron right there, and let's add that to it. So, raw iron, like, you know, 20,000 of that, like, two, three, four. How many potassium? We get 6,099 potassium in the end as well. So, we've got a heck of a load of stuff in that top chest as well. Um, so, you can see we pretty much stripped most things out of all these rooms. We have done so much in this sub city, but it's day 19, guys, which means day 21 horde is coming pretty soon and we even did like a little bit of mining here this is what this was where we first found the uh i'll, I'll go show you guys this. this is where this is where we first found the potassium and uh a load of lead we uh we dug a shaft mine down here i started it off and then yeah out of all this though i think we only got like 2,000 potassium there wasn't much down here it was mainly lead so uh yeah so anyway we've got to decide what stuff uh we've got to decide what stuff we want to take with us and then get the crap out of here because uh i don't know about you say but i've had enough of dogs and ferals and cops how about you? Yes. Yeah. Yes, indeed. I mean, and I'd like to get back to base and start upgrading stuff and getting ready for the 21-day horde. Indeed. So, uh, yeah, we're going to uh, kind of decide what the best course of action of stuff to take is, and then we're going to go back to base, and we'll see you there. <laughs> Saber is banned from the forging area. <laughs> Hi, Saber. Let's see how you are. But I, I, I was, at least I was courteous and gave you a remark, H, and I gave you three ways out of it, too. It's just that, like, you got infected and I needed to, uh, ah. oh, say that, now you're destroying a remark. I needed to, like, quarantine myself because you got infected in the city, so, uh, <laughs> you know, I, I thought, it, I thought it was safe that you were in there and I was out here. <laughs> Alrighty, let's put those back in the box now. Hi, Saber. <laughs> <laughs> but but you had to admit it wasn't as bad as last time. This time you had more room, and the cage was made of stronger materials. Mm -hmm. Right. So, mm -hmm. so, so, so it's better, right? Mm-hmm. Right. Mm-hmm. Saber. Mm -hmm. Hi, sorry. <laughs> no response. <laughs> I'm surprised you haven't shot me with a bolt yet. He were there being yet. Huh? He were there being yet. <laughs> <laughs> Are you annoyed with me, Saber Star? Nah. <laughs> That's alright. You're fine. Though. Have, uh, have I uh, have I gone down in your in your uh, in your opinion now? Ah, <laughs> you're having fun. Are you having fun, Saver? Yeah, <laughs> always having fun. <laughs> you're just like, why yeah. would I not be? You're just like, yeah. <laughs> then like, no. <laughs> why would I not be having fun? I don't know. <laughs> Being trapped in the cage, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> it's that's that's funny shit. <laughs> I would do that. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> it is. It's funny shit. All right. Which one of these has a lead? Alrighty, guys. We are finally back at the base, and as you can see, uh, I've gone ahead and put down a ton of uh, rebar frames around here. Now, all our forges are currently producing up concrete mix. Well, most of them are. There's a couple producing up more rebar and stuff. But um, we want to get Saber's rooftop garden going. Um, so there's a lot of stuff that we've got to do in the meantime. Now, in order to do that, we've actually got to get the walls done so that we can support the roof, because... Otherwise, you know, the whole thing is going to collapse and that won't be fun. So we need to get the adequate supports in place. So getting the rebar down and sorted is probably the first thing that we've got to do. So I'm marking it out and then uh, Saver's coming to uh, do the upgrade arch. And that's the last Eey. bit of mine. So what we're going to have to do is make this five blocks high, I'm thinking. And then we're going to have to... Uh, I'm going to turn my torch on because it is actually quite, kind of dark today. And we've come up with a, uh, a cool little uh, design for being able to access the stuff um, from inside, uh, from outside the base. So all the stuff on the inside of the base in those storage containers, we've come up with a little way to be able to access them from the outside. And uh, I'll go and show you that in a minute. Um, you guys are uh, probably getting an idea from, from like seeing what I'm doing now to placing the blocks down. I'll come and show you in just a sec. So first of all, we are going to get all these placed down, and I think Saber's uh, having a whale of a time upgrading them out there. 
I am. She sure <laughs> and is. while I was out here, I thought I would show everyone. I put some railings up. Yes, they look So I will awesome. no longer fall off. And I really like these little wedge corners, I believe is what they're called. Yeah. Um, wedge. They're pretty, yes, wood pretty catwalk wedge corner railing. Yes. So, yeah, they're pretty nifty. They are pretty cool. I like them. Um, yeah, we can walk all around, and now I don't have to worry about falling off. Whee! I was thinking I should do concrete on the back first because that seems to be where they always come from yeah that makes sense we can do it, do it from the back that sounds like a plan saber star um so yeah, i'm just gonna go ahead and put the rebar there and there we go this is pretty much like the wall bit and now i'm just gonna go and get some um just want to make sure we can get off the ramp yeah let me let me go and test it so we're gonna have to leave part of an opening here yeah, I've I've done that right there. We should be fine. It should be it should be okay. Let's have a quick look. So if we can get off. It's it's more getting in that I think is the problem. Yeah, we can get off. Yeah, I'm out. It's a bit of a bit of a weird one, but I can get off. Once you have the actual drawbridge stuff in there, it's gonna be a lot easier um, to do yeah. this. Yeah, 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 yeah. Absolutely. Right. Let me check. Right, you're not on the back side of the base, are you? Because um, I'm about to come out the ramp. I don't. Wanna, I, I, don't I am, run you but you're not you're not gonna run into me. You're fine. Incoming! But I want to see. Can I get in? Uh, oh, way! I get in. I still get in. I just hit the top. <laughs> and I, and I shoot in. That's fine. That's fine. So we can do that. I think that'll be fine. So what I need to do as well is get myself some. Oh of crap! The... I didn't mean to do that. What, what did you do? You do? Oh, that's fine. I, had, I didn't. I had uh, steel on me to fix stuff and. Uh, it's it's yeah. gonna be eventually. It's all gonna be steel anyway. So I would not worry about it at all. So uh, uh, I'm just gonna put my stuff away so I don't accidentally do that again. <laughs> okay. Right. Let's get. Um, I think we're gonna need like 30 of the ramp frames, um, so that we can get the. Uh, a bit done, I think, but we'll see. We'll see what it's like in a minute. Uh, I'll get those out now. Okay, I think 12 will do just because I'm thinking of uh, trying to think of how we want to do the uh, inset bit. But I'll come and show you guys what the inset bit is so that we can access things from the outside. So, uh, currently, we've got a door here which I've uh, forgot to conveniently forgot to place a frame on the actual bit where the top of the door is. Let me just go and quickly do that right now before Saber eats my face. And uh, let's have a look. That's got to go there, and I've done it for that side as well. So yeah, you can see now we've got like two doors coming out here, one each side, so we can get out both sides of the base. That's the mini bike bit, so we can kind of just step out here as well. So nice and nice little area to come out from. So just have a look at this bit. So this is like the, uh, this is the inset bit that... Um, it was kind of Saber's idea to have it inset like this, um, so we can access it from the outside. So Saber's gone and made all the signs up here, as you can see. And now we can literally just come down here. Um, when we're outside shooting the zombies, we can just come around here and get to the boxes that have to go all the way inside first. Um, and that's going to be awesome. So hopefully that's going to support the concrete. I would go for that one as well, make sure it's done. There we go. So yeah, this is pretty much just the walls. As you can see, it's nothing amazing, nothing special. But what we need we need this for is so that we can then go and get the rooftop garden. So what we're going to do eventually is, uh, if we get a bit of time, we're going to go and expand this roof all the way out to the walls there. So then we can have a, a rooftop garden. And the screamers appeared. So uh, I'm going to go deal with that one. So Saber is upgrade lady. I am destroy screamer man. So let's go and see where, see where these guys are at. Hey! Get out of the way. Get out of here. Right, where's she at? I see ya. Perched on the my barbed wire. This is for horde zombies only. Get off. You're not a horde zombie. You are scout zombie. Off you go. Right, she's gone. Let's you call some people? Yep. Yeah, of course she did. She's always calling people. She's like the most, she was like the most popular girl in school, that one. Right, and on. I missed somehow. Way. And I missed again. Wow, I'm stuck in at my sniping today. Oh, and a third time. Son of a. Okay. <laughs> you can do They're it, Saber. It's okay. heading towards you. They are. They live me. All right. This is just all right. Okay, I think my uh, I think my. I just have to laugh at myself there. because otherwise I'll just cry. I can't believe how bad I'm sucking right Saber, now. Saber, Saber, you're doing fine. Don't worry. Right, so uh, there's another putrid girl. Got her in the face as she fell down. That was awesome. 
Right, so yeah, this is a... Uh... Oh, there's a crawler there as well. Hey! God! <laughs> 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 I was like, uh, bang, gone. <laughs> oh, right, I have a little stamina. Oh, oh, a crawler broke my leg, the little bugger. That's why I'm moving so slow. Oh no! No, oh, no! That means I can't jump as high. Oh no! Oh well, I need to go in and uh, get uh, get splinted up again, so let me go and quickly uh, do that. Now, we haven't left these three crates open, or these sets of crates open. Um, oh, and Saber, we've got an additional crate, haven't we? Why don't you tell the guys about the uh, the additional crate that we put in? Ah, oh, yes, I can come in and do that. Yeah. Hang on. Yeah, we, we, have a, we have a new addition to the crate family. Um, so I think... Yes, yeah. we got so much stuff. We now have one called Metallica. And Hell guess yeah. what's inside? There's like absolutely tons of sand in there. Now, there was a lot more sand, but we've made so much concrete mix um, coming out of this thing that um, we kind of used most of the sand that we did get. But at the time, this rocky box was so full that we needed more. So we just yes. had to make tons more and you can see that we're getting like loads of stuff melted up in here nearly all of this is turned into cement now which is awesome we just have to finish off that and then we should have uh, the rest of this Ooh. uh all entirely sorted so let's quickly get more of that cooked up as well in there as well there's some steel coming out of that so uh can we make more steel we can only make iron in that i'll just get one piece of iron out of there may as well get that going is that done yep so you can turn it off Otherwise, we're going to burn through witches unnecessarily, and we don't want to do that. So, let's go ahead and... Yeah, I need to plant some more trees. I just didn't want to do it in the middle of the night, and they were all running around. Yeah, that wouldn't be good. Right, there you go. But and... yes, if you if you look, I chopped down every single freaking tree. <laughs> let's, have, let's have a look, because uh, once there was a beautiful forest, then there was plains. <laughs> For the mysterious saber had chopped down all the trees in existence. Pretty much. Yeah. Right, so, uh, yeah, so, although we kind of went to the Hub City to, uh, you know, get loot, we ended up doing so much mining in the Hub City that most of the stuff that we brought back was mining materials. Yeah. Which is pretty good. Ah, crapiola. Oh, well. Crapiola. Yeah, upgraded a wood frame. You didn't mean to, but oh well. Yeah, I'm, I'm having a little bit of a lag, so that's part of the issue is trying yeah, to aim. Having, having a lag spike on there. Um, yeah, so what we're going to do eventually is this uh, this bit here that you guys can see on my screen right now with the uh, wood pole. That's going to be a concrete pole eventually, because what we're, what we're thinking is if a cop somehow manages to puke over the top of the... Uh, of the barbed wire here, um, or not the barbed wire, sorry, the, uh, the catwalk thingy here, um, it's only going to be able to get in there if this is completely open, but if there's these blocks in front of it, then the puke will hit those blocks first, and therefore the boxes won't get destroyed. And even if it does get through there, it's got to destroy the signs first before it actually gets to the box. So hopefully our stuff is going to be uh, nice and safe. Um, so yeah, the, hopefully being the uh, predominant word, because we've never tried this before. So uh, yeah, it's a bit of experimentation, so... Lots of stuff to uh, lots of stuff to try, but once we've got this all upgraded to uh, concrete, we actually have um, we then are going to have enough to uh, start Saber's uh, rooftop garden, which will be really awesome. And I can't wait to see what she comes up with there. So uh, she is <laughs> she is construction lady for that part. So uh, I'm going to be following her orders like a uh, like a good little Max Fox Gaming. All right, I'll go back around. I was trying to do the bottom ones first. Yeah, I'm kind just sort of thing. I'm just doing it as I as I see them. I'm see this is why you're the organizy lady and I'm just the crappyola man. Well, I was kind of doing it randomly, but then I was sitting here thinking, well, I know we don't have a ton, so I was trying to get all the bottom ones first because that's where the cops yeah. are gonna hit first. True. And plus, structurally, that's probably better as well. Yeah. Well, all the blocks are upgraded and right now are connected to the ground, so. It's actually fine on this part. Um, so anything we upgrade there, I think that's all of it. Let's just go and double check. Uh, it looks like it is. Yeah. That's, that's, that, that's that really all of it? That's really ah. all of it. That's done. So now what we've got to do is uh, start actually working on the rooftop bit. So uh, what we're going to need to do, though, is probably... Um, 
bring you know the poles that we've got from down the bottom we're probably going to uh -huh. wanna, we're probably going to want to bring those up to this bit so that they can support the roof because one thing i've heard is uh when the crops grow they actually add weight to the roof and uh there have been some people that have had like wooden roofs and things and had a rooftop garden they had like a tree farm or a crop farm on the top it grew and it actually caused their base to collapse so um ah. so yeah we don't want that to happen to our base so we're gonna have to find where the uh where the poles come in from underneath and bring them up and what we can right. do is use the uh rebar we can use the rebar concrete uh, the pillar frames like we use down the bottom and uh just for you guys uh just for you guys so you know i've actually gone and upgraded the entire bottom area down here to reinforce concrete as well so everything down here is now reinforced so we have a nice way in to uh, get in here so it's all uh, nice and tough so if anything does manage to penetrate through the uh, exterior it's not going to cause too much havoc down here uh, by destroying everything because if this is still cobblestone yeah. i'd be worried but it's not anymore it's now you know full reinforced concrete it will be steel eventually but the priority is the outside bit at the bottom to get that all done um i don't know if we're going to end up getting that done for day 21 but you know we've got a day we got like a day and a half left before they show up so there's plenty of time to you know get it all sorted so yeah we got to work out where the bars are going to come up from uh, i think is the next bit yeah i'll let you do on. that i'll let you figure out the bars and i'm gonna all plant right. a crap ton of trees all righty then so let me go ahead and get some rebar pillars out of it uh, is it pole or pillar? Pillar. There we go. Rebar pillar 100. How many can I make? I can make 669. We're definitely not going to need that many, so I think I'm going to make, like, I think 100 would do. I think that's all we're going to need. We might need We might need some more, but I think for now, 100 will be absolutely gorgeous. So let's go ahead and make those. Now, we shouldn't need too much, because what we can do is on the top, we can use metal trussing on the roof level. And a scream has come. But you know what, I'm gonna let her die while I'm working stuff out. So yeah, we could use uh, we could use like eventually metal trussing and that'll make it really, really nice and strong. Or yeah. we could even use um did you did you see what I did in, in my single player base with the scrap frames with the wood plate underneath them? To make it look like it's wood, but then be as strong as iron. I I did see that, yes. Yeah, we could do that, considering that nothing's gonna be hitting inside here. It seems pointless to use like more expensive material when scrap frames are like just as good. So maybe we can do that. But uh, yeah, we'll see. We'll see. We'll see how we go. Right. So uh, the trapdoor is here. So first of all, I'm going to work out the interior ones. So the trapdoor's there. So I think one of them is going to be there. Now, unfortunately, I don't have an axe because I uh, very generously donated it to uh, Saber Star. Um, so I'm going to have to make myself a. Uh, I'll make myself a stone axe. It's probably going to be fine for now. Um, and I don't really fancy. You know, waiting a whole minute for steel. So let's get some. Uh, there stuff should be up. some in the ironic box, forged steel, already. If you want some, I put some in there. Hang on, is there an axe? Is there even an axe? Oh, there's a fire axe in here. It's an iron one, but and really bad, but it might be enough to get through the wood. Right. So let's have a look here then. So we need one here. Is that correct? Yep. There's a square right there. And there's a square right there. There we go. And scream is dead. Excellent. It's always, uh, always nice. Okay, so this is where we're going to bring up the first one. So we're going to have a, a square there. So now we're going to work out. So it seems to be one diagonal block. And Okay, well, here's where we're going to run into our first problem. We need to move the door. <laughs> because uh, right now, the uh, one of the poles is going to be right in front of it. So I'll work on getting that door moved. Unfortunately, I did upgrade it to like a good hard metal door. But we can move it somewhere. So it'll be fine. Let me see where we could move it to. What we could do is we could move it. I guess we could move it to the side um, where the campfires are, because then we can then we'll have room to step out. Yeah, I'm gonna do that. So let's go ahead and uh, break through this door. Uh, it's gonna take a while, so I'll just break through this now. There's like three layers on this thing, so it might be a little bit of time before we actually get through this thing. But yeah, that's what you get for upgrading a door fully and then realizing that you placed it wrong like an idiot. But, oh well. Let's just break through here. It's only 2,500 each, so it's not that much. Right, here we go. So let's start breaking through. Here's the last layer. So one more. And that should be fine after that. There we go. So one there. Excellent. Okay, so that's that bit taken out, and then we'll replace the door 
a little bit later. So, next bit is we need to uh, work out where these other ones are placed. So, technically, if one is there, there should be a three block thing here. And then if we take this one out, there it is. There is the next one. So, the next pillar is going to come up through this bit here. So, let's go ahead and do that. And the actual fire axe has broken. Way <laughs> so we gotta actually fix it. Uh, do I have the forge iron on me? Yes, I do. Let me just. Let me. I know it's a really crappy one, but let me. Let me just repair it anyway. Solve it. So, still at quality 15. So, maybe it'll destroy it faster now. Who knows? Let's have a little quick look. Right. So let's break through here. So there's pillar number two. So pillar number three is going to be three blocks along. So it's going to be like here I think that looks like three it's hard to tell like going sideways on the wood and I think I need to move Saber's mini bike back a little bit there we go so I think number three is gonna be here yeah there's there's a steel one there because I accidentally upgraded it but let me just make sure that's three. One, two, three. huzzah that is the one so we're gonna go and take this one and then eventually these pillars will be steel as well it'll all be steel on the yeah. inside but for right now Concrete is good enough. Uh, right. Definitely so need to make a tree farm because I'm just wandering around in circles and getting <laughs> too close to the base, closer than I intended to. Oh dear. Right. Okay. So yeah. I think one of the pillars is actually in the right place as it is right now. But let's have a look. So there's one there. Yep, that's one. So one, two, three. Yep. So I think. Yeah, one of the pillars is actually in the right place. That is awesome. Uh, we're gonna have to take it out anyway because it's wood and we want it concrete. But it's a good start. So. We kind of knew what we were doing when we marked this little area out. So I'm going to take that one down. Don't collapse. Yay, the roof didn't collapse on us. Awesome. That's always good. All right, so let's get rid of uh, these ones. And then this one here. And that should be all done. And then the fourth pillar is going to come up through this bit right here. So let's go ahead and take these pillars out here so we can get rid of the floor now this should still hold considering that there is like cross bracing underneath this so don't worry the whole thing is not going to fall down i have thought this through kind of um right so there we go and now we can get the rebar in here let's go ahead and do that so we can have four rebars in that one and then we're going to go ahead and do it for the others as well so let me get my fire axe i don't need a wrench right now i got a nail gun why do i need a wrench i got a nail gun right so these ones out and then once we've done this bit we will be able to raise the pillars up and through so there's that one and here's number three i'm still planting trees you're still planting trees yes you're alive i'm just planting away you're still alive well i'm glad i'm glad you're still alive i wouldn't want anything to happen to my saber star well i know i was being quiet there so i was just explaining yeah. <laughs> Yeah, I know you, you're concentrating on uh, tree planting matters. I know, I know it's important. We do need a tree farm, though, definitely. Yeah, because this is like seriously chaotic over here. <laughs> I, I <know. laughs> feel like all over the place. Right, so now we can go ahead and upgrade these, and there we go. So now we have the uh, foundations for bringing the pillars up to the next level, which is just what we need. And oh, I'm out of concrete! Hooray! So let me go and get some more. Thank you very much. Right, let's go and do that one. There we go. So now we have the pillars upgraded. So the next thing i got to do is, of course, move the door over. So I'm going to need a wood frame. And let's go and head make... I only need one. So Saber might be confused as to where the new door location is, but she'll find it. <laughs> and, right, wood frame. Wood frame. Where are you? Where are you? Aha! There you are. Wood frame. I need. I really need to favorite it, but I know. I, I I'm probably one of the few people that never uses the favorites menu. I don't know why I don't, but oh well. Right. So wood frame there and there. Actually, I might want to go on the inside and do this coming outwards, so that I don't accidentally like destroy anything as I make the door. That would be a good idea. Right. Now I've trapped myself in. So we need to put. Another, <laughs> we need to put another door in somewhere. So I think what we could do is have it like right there. Because that'll be, that'll be fine. It's near the campfires, but it's fair. It's probably the only reasonable place we could do it. Because that wall's full of boxes. That wall's got the chemistry stations and things. So, and that wall's got my bedroll on. And Saber moved hairs away from me. She must hate me. So, I moved it because I was moving the benches and everything over. So. Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, that, that, that's what Saber says, but I know she I know she secretly hates me for trapping her in that rebar cage. <laughs> she goes, I'm not sleeping next to you anymore. Right, so the new door can go here. And there we go. So now we've got the location for the new door. And it's pretty much right next to a pillar. So now the other thing we just got to check is that this isn't going to get in the way of the mini bikes too much. It shouldn't do... No, actually, that shouldn't do at all, actually. It might might do on the way out, but on the coming in one, it should be it should be fine. So next thing we're going to do is go ahead and get the, uh, the pillar ones put in. Now, unfortunately, um, the two lights that we've got there are also in the way. So I need to take those out. Um, so let's go ahead and... Uh, Get the lights out of the way. We'll replace them though. We got so many electrical parts from the uh, from the hub city that we're definitely going to be able to replace these nice and easy. Now, Saber Star, do you want the roof on the same level as uh, what it is now, or do you want it one higher? Um, not sure what you mean. Like, you know where the roof currently is at the moment on the on the level that it is. Do you want? Is that where you want the roof, or do you want me, to, or do you want to put that, push the whole roof one higher from where it is? No, yeah, it should be fine. The, the only reason we needed it tall at the bottom was because if they were going to stand on the spikes, then we wanted to make sure that you know they couldn't get to the walkway and stuff. Cool. Okay. In that case, I will. Uh, uh, that should be fine. Yeah. I'll keep that at the same level then, so we can have that there, and then we're going to need to go and bring the other one. Right. Uh, please don't break leg. Please don't break leg. I broke leg. Never mind. Okay. Splint is necessary. Oh, man, I'm low on health. Uh, okay, I'm going to eat some food to uh, recover some uh, some health while I'm waiting. And uh, Scream has just lost her legs, which is awesome. She's around the uh, north side of the base saver, so just don't go that way and it'll be fine. Uh, so let me eat that. So that should start healing me a little bit. And once we got our rooftop farm, we can then start making the, uh, the, corn, the corn meal and getting all the stews and the stuff together as well and then we'll be great after that point right so it sounds like the screamers died which is good right what was i doing i was getting a splint wasn't i so yeah i need to go in the fix me chest there we go and use one of those there we go leg is gonna heal now and i should probably just take a pain pill as well just so that i'm not too low on health so use that and of course that's put me at zero percent hydration so now i've got to drink something so drink me Go ahead and do gold rot tea. And Just got a few more trees to plant, and then that's going to be our time. Damn. Really? Yeah. That went quick. But to yeah. be fair, we have been like doing stuff. Although, guy, although you guys have only seen like three hours worth of stuff, we I think we've been playing for like I don't know, like close to eleven hours right now, <laughs> doing all the stuff. Yeah. So yeah, yeah, pretty much. There's a lot of stuff that's happened off camera that you guys haven't seen, but most of it has pretty much been you know mining because um, we do a lot of that because we want we want resources and things like that so yeah it kind of has to be done but yeah okay so uh once i've got these in we can upgrade those and then we can call it an episode then i guess so let me just oh. get that out and then the last thing we need to do is of course extend these ones up to the top as well so what i'm gonna do is uh i may as well do these on camera why not why not so there's that one, and now once we got that one in, we should be able to just put the others against it like that. And then we can upgrade all these in a minute. And then the last one in... Oh, that one, that one upgraded to uh, reinforced concrete already. That was awesome. So, uh, oh, wrong, wrong place. So that can go there, to there, to there, and to there. No, right, let's see if Saver can find the door. Well, where the door is going to be. Let's see if she finds it. <laughs> and I'm out of frames. Way she found the door. <laughs> <laughs> and I need two more of those pillars. Actually, we've got quite a few. So, uh, so how many uh, how many trees did you plant out there, Saber Star? Over two hundred trees. Over two hundred. Yeah. <laughs> Believe it or not, it took a while, but yeah, I it did does. it. You get you get such a you get such a huge amount of seeds, though, don't you? Like. From doing yeah. it like it's quite ridiculous how many you get so the last thing we got to do then is uh simply get these and turn these three into concrete so i think one is there all right let's see where we're at so so i have taken that out right yep so there's one 
and this will be the second one and then we'll be able to uh, put the concrete stuff in here and then upgrade that so let's go ahead and get these ones out of the way one two three four and then we'll put these uh, rebar frames in here and i only have four rebar frames left perfect i'm just gonna get some more and now that means i've got to oh no i don't have to break my leg but i never had to break my leg in the first place i could have gone on the roof and come down Ah, I'm such an idiot. Oh well. Um, real <laughs> <friends. laughs> <laughs> Right. So, so are we gonna expand this room out a bit? Um, I'm sure we will do eventually. Yes. Um, as for for right now, it, we shouldn't need to because, like, you know, we've got the day twenty one horde coming in like a day and a bit. But once we've uh, once we've got it past that, I think then yes, we'll definitely want to expand it a little bit. Alrighty. Right, so last one to do, and then I'll be done. And then uh, we can end off the episode. Oh, and of course, I had to upgrade that one, so it takes even longer to actually get out. <laughs> oh, God damn it. But, yeah. So, yeah, pretty much a bit of a looty and a building episode this time, which is uh, a bit different, as I know you guys have seen, uh, like, us looting a lot in the uh, in the past week. But, you know, mm -hmm. considering we did do a lot of building the week before, I thought, you know, it might be a good idea to have more lootage. Okay, there we go, and then the last pillar is in. So literally, all we have to do, guys, is upgrade those to concrete, um, and then what we can do is, uh, I'll probably upgrade these to steel, and replace all this wood with the scrap frames, because um, you got tons of iron, and then that will allow for a nice strong roof up the top, which is then going to support all the plants that Saber is going to grow up here. So, uh, I think we are good to end off the episode, so I hope you guys enjoyed this one, and we will see you in the next one. So, until then, bye!